And welcome back to the Anime Den. This time around we of course got something fairly cool. It's the Alpha Max. It's the Miku Hatsune Lamb. This is an October 2013 release. So of course it, the figure's about probably just shy of 8 inches tall. Maybe 6 inches tall. It doesn't matter. It's from Krypton. You know, it's a Krypton. It's Miku Hatsune and it's cool. So we'll take a quick tour of the outer side of the box. Of course, obviously, window display. This is very typical. Yeah, you have a nice little bit down here. It tells you what it is. You take a side view of the box. Again, it's still windowed here and it gives you a nice little picture of what's inside. I mean, it's an Android style figure, so there's not a lot to see. You know, it's not like we're going to be seeing, you know, there's a lot to it. And of course, there's obviously all your obligatory information in Japanese, of course. And of course, the side again is just another image of Miku. The top again, it's just that window top, tells you what it is, who it's from. It's a non scaled figure. And black. Because we didn't come to see that, we came to actually look at the figure. So just give us two moments and we'll have this figure out. And sorry for that little pause there, I had to step away and get a knife. So we're gently, 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 gently open this. We love factory sealed. Factory sealed's cool. And let's get Miku out and have a look. Or just discard the box. See so what we see straight is we get dual layers. So of course first layer is Miku in a plastic sealed cut or blow mold basically, a little safety pack, and of course then there's a stand. Let's have a quick look at the stand. It's time to bust that trusty knife out again. So we'll start with the stand, of course it's that very nice Vocaloid inspired sort of stand, nice little musical notes on the top of it. It's, this is sort of has a bit of a Halloween theme about it, they were trying to push it as a bit of a Halloween thing. And because it's that nice PVC plastic and it's got all the, the wonderful little trademark stamp underneath. Oh, where are we? If we can see it. Oh, that's not even going to help. And of course it has the pegs for... There we go, the pegs for Miku's feet. So that's the stand. Now let's get Miku out. Let me just discard this plastic pack. One of the things that falls out, this is actually a little lantern that sits in Miku's hand. There we go, Let's see if we can get it a little bit better looking. Again, PVC plastic, so nothing too special. And of course, then there's Miku. And surprisingly, oh, sorry, had her out of camera shot there. So the lamps are actually part of her headset. They have that nice little sort of tail down on both sides the tassels through her hair because she's got a nice little oh my god Miku is doing the whole Polti guys thing she's got a nice little root rose happening off the back of her costume because it's that trademark costume that you always see her in and of course obviously you see a headset we give a look at the back of the head and it's a little semi translucent which would give the impression that maybe it will glow in the dark I'm not entirely sure and she just presses down on her stand just like that and of course we'll just bring her across now I don't know if she actually goes in the dark so let's find out we'll just have a quick look see and apparently not so it's just a translucent running in her actual hair so oh well 
But it's a nice statue. It's a very nice statue. Very expensive statue, but it is obviously, you know, it's Vocaloid. It's from the Good Smile Company. Everything they make is expensive. And I dare say she's actually more like about six inches. So I was wrong at the start. I said eight inches. I reckon she's more like about six inches. But that's it. That's the Alpha Max lamp version of Miku Hatsune. Thank you very much for watching, and we will see you next time. Oh, as a little side note, since I didn't look in the bottom of the box, of course, you get the postcard. Oh, oh it doesn't really work. But it's a postcard from Hasane Miku, which is, of course, just an image of the statue. So that's my little MV. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time.